Since I talked about one episode from Mau Mau Heroes of Pure Heart back in October as part of my Halloween May reviews, I'm honestly surprised that I got more attention as time went by. To tell you the truth, when people miss shows like this, when it comes to Cartoon Network, it really shows that they really enjoy what Cartoon Network would have done after Steven Universe came to an end. But to tell you the truth, thinking about how that this show got the axe like the other shows, I'm I honestly have my impressions on the first episode mostly minimum, mainly the fact that after watching the episode that I've talked about as part of Halloween Mania, my hopes aren't really that high, but at the same time, I'm giving this show more of a chance after giving it a chance back at Halloween Mania. So for the first episode of Mao Mao, what do I think of it? It's not terrible, and I can totally understand that the style of this show is mainly its own thing, like every other Cartoon Network show, but at the same time, the only problem I have with it is that it was a little too fast-paced. And with this episode's introduction of a drawback scene affection in Mau Mau for saving Pure Heart Valley, I felt like that it would have worked if this episode wasn't fast-paced. I mean, if it's mainly the comedy that it's doing when it comes to its fast-paced nature, okay, KO did much more better, and that's mainly the fact that that show was in a different setting of different characters in comparison to the setting and characters from this. For Mau Mau with the debut episode of his show, I'm gonna be really honest with you, when it comes to him being an ego, when it comes to his fantasy, I'm fully aware that I'm not gonna like those types of characters. It may be the first episode, but at the same time, if the village of Pure Heart or the Pure Heart Village as what it's called is showcasing the what friendship is like, I can totally understand that a character like Mao Mao would be able to cool down in order to see friendship in the eyes of the people in Pure Heart Valley, but whenever I think about Mao Mao after watching this episode, I find it difficult to find any relatability from this character when he's trying to take himself seriously. I mean, granted, Taking yourself seriously is important when it comes to the stuff that you're witnessing, when it comes to a hero or not. But for a character that has an ego while taking things seriously by being a hero, I'm starting to convince that his development later on will showcase that he's mostly incompetent despite being a good hero. I'm not saying that... I hate Mao Mao. I think that he has potential, but at the same time, Mao Mao just feels a lot more complicated for me because those two elements of having an ego and taking taking things seriously are really different from each other. And even if you may work it out when it comes to his character, I'm still gonna have a difficult time into seeing the qualities for that character if it's gonna be portrayed like that as I watch more episodes. With the doorbat finding adornment and support towards Mawa Mawa after seeing him facing off enemies, I wouldn't be surprised to fix once he or she figures out that he is mainly mostly incompetent when it comes to the stuff that he does other than facing off enemies. I'm being a little negative, but at the same time, my impressions of this show, in comparison to the other impressions that I have with other Cartoon Network shows, aren't really the best, and like I said, it's at a minimum. I'm just saying right now that my perspective towards this first episode isn't as good as what everyone else makes it out to be. I mean, if you still like this episode, that's fine, and I can understand you got into this show in your own point of view, but in my point of view... Aside from the action sequences, I still find it difficult to find any enjoyment from this show, especially after watching the episode centering around the cane of Pure Heart Valley, or the Kingdom of Pure Heart Valley, or something like that. I'm just saying right now that my impressions is always at a minimum, but after watching this episode, I wasn't really expecting much. It is a first episode, but at the same time, I found other episodes that were first in the series that didn't try hard, and yet at the same time, they still, they, they were still entertaining in this. 
At times, this show is supposed to be cute when it comes to the pure heart citizens or the pure heart valley citizens that are cute to them Mau Mau who's supposed to be taking himself seriously despite the ego and I'll admit I do like those aspects in other cartoons but the reason why it didn't work out for me in this is mainly the fact that I couldn't get invested with the main characters that much and Adorbat despite being the best character in this show which isn't this which isn't saying a lot it wasn't enough for me to find any investment due to the other problems. Like, Adorbat, she can be really likable, especially with her stopping the antagonist's ship. But at the same time, if this is a friendship centering around Mao Mao and Adorbat when it comes to them being close with each other, and if that's gonna be the saving grace of this, I really expected a lot more when it comes to Mau Mau's character and the door patch because, like I said before, if she figure out who Mau Mau really is, and even though that the episodes I've talked about in October were like 20 episodes after this, there has to be more execution involving the relationship between Mau Mau and a door bat. I know it's too much to ask for, but at the same time, if people actually enjoy this dynamic and I don't, then it's literally the only expecta expectation I have involving this show if I'm going to binge watch it. So, as far as I'm concerned, this episode, especially for a first episode of this show, isn't bad, but it didn't got me invested. I may have done this for the sake of getting more views like in my last Mau Mau review, but at the same time, I'm only trying to showcase my point of view on what I feel about the first episode until I get into more. There is a chance that I, might, that I may binge watch this show, but at the same time with this year being mostly busy, especially during the summer, Mau Mau Heroes of Pure Heart is still at the end of my list by doing videos of, knowing for a while that I just couldn't be able to get invested with this show yet just like the other shows that I did in the past, mainly We Bell Bells from 2020 and other cartoons. I know it's not a style that people would enjoy for me to do, but at the same time, that's basically what happens whenever I try to get into a cartoon and it takes time for me to get invested. You will probably feel the same way too. Bottom line, this is a mediocre start, but it would take time for me to actually get invested even if it won't happen anytime soon. So with that being said, I'm giving this episode a 6.25 out of 10.